This is a great entry level product from a very, very well respected brand that has some of the most high quality ingredients for any nootropic. Hey, what's up guys, it's Josh here. Today I wanna to do a little re-review on this Genius Consciousness. Now, Genius Consciousness is really expensive. I think it's like $38 on Amazon for only 15 servings. If you go ahead and look on eBay, you can find these for much cheaper. That's what I recommended in my original review of this product. So I'm somebody who vehemently avoids artificial colors. I can't have them in anything, but most of the time, even though there's no artificial colors, there's some artificial sweeteners and there isn't any in this product, which I really, really like. And it is a very, very high quality blend. Let's just jump into the ingredients here. So acetyl L-carnitine. Now, carnitine is great for boosting brain health, but it also is good for fat burning as well. And a gram is pretty much my go-to dose for carnitine. So it is fully dosed in this mix. Then you got lion's mane mushroom extract, which I don't know if you guys have seen that Joe Rogan clip, but the lion's mane stimulates uh, neurite outgrowth, 22% increase in neurite uh, outgrowth, increases myelin regeneration on the sheath of the nerves. There's all these impressive things that lion's mane mushrooms can do. I think it can help um, reverse some effects of dementia and reverse some effects of brain damage and things like that. So it's always great to have it. It's a very good nootropic. I appreciate it in this blend. It's more for general health versus feeling some sort of effect. All right, now you got a hefty dose of alpha GPC. Now alpha GPC is one of the more expensive kinds of choline. Usually, I mean, it's dosed at about 300 to 400 milligrams. So 600 milligrams is a very hefty dose here. And then we got tyrosine, a very respectable dose of 500 milligrams. I have seen tyrosine up to 750 or 1000 milligrams per scoop in some blends and it is one of my favorite awakening products period. But 500 milligrams is very solid. Now you got this dynamine and dynamine, I, I've said this in my other videos, I'm just not the biggest fan of dynamine. It feels very similar to caffeine to me. I find that caffeine is a little bit more balanced. If I have too much caffeine and just even a little bit of dynamine, it'll put me over the edge. So I just don't have too much uses for it, but there is only hundred milligrams caffeine in this mix. So it's not like it's going to put you over the edge. Some people really like dynamine. It's just not for me. And then you have this caffeine from coffee beans, hundred milligrams, very solid dose. Not really going to put anybody over the edge but it should be enough to feel it. So the serenade and this neurofactor, I've looked them both up before. They're supposed to both help some sort of excitement and alertness. I've tried them a lot before. I really appreciate them. I think this estrogen product is supposed to increase absorption. If not, I will put it on screen, but I've seen this estrogen in plenty of products. Then the last thing we got here is basically um, hyperzine A, which is a backdoor to put more choline in the body versus just taking choline by itself. So you are gonna have that alpha GPC in here. So you're getting actual choline and then you're getting this thing to boost more choline in the body. So it's just this double choline effect. So as far as the effects of this stuff, honestly, I really don't feel too much. And it's weird because I used to love this supplement. The taste is a little bit off. I don't really know if it's that dynamine. Dynamine never really tastes good at all, but this blend has just been okay for me. It hasn't been anything that's really wowed me. I think I need something else with like uh, some Roscolin in it, some DMHA, some DMAA, some Amp Citrate, some Area Gerenesis, something with an extra little oomph of excitement um, that I don't find in this product. It's very solid. I really don't know why I'm not really having the effects that I usually have because I like all these ingredients. I've tried them all before and they're great, but I'm gonna be honest, it's just been solid middle of the pack for me but this is a great entry-level product from a very very well respected brand that has some of the most high quality ingredients for any nootropic so I think this is honestly great if you're somebody who wants something that's not hardcore that's a good base of a lot of nootropics I just did a review on war games and I find that this is a little bit more accessible to the beginner than war games I find that war games is also a entry level nootropic mix. I like war games a lot too, but I would say that most people would probably like this one more. It has more of a nootropic style blend in it. I just really like how high quality these ingredients are. I just, for me, need something with an extra little bite to it, a little extra oomph in there that I don't get, unfortunately. So 
Anyways, guys, Genius Consciousness, very solid product, very middle of the road, just doesn't do anything extra, but I don't regret getting it, don't regret trying it. It's a very, very solid compound. So anyways, guys, what nootropics have you been trying? Have you tried this Genius Consciousness? I'd be very interested to see down below. We're on the road at 50,000 subscribers, and I couldn't do it without any of your guys' help. You guys are the best. Having a great day out here. Hopefully having a great day at home. See you all in the next video. Peace.